Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name's Kat and today we're doing something a little bit different. As some of you may or may not already know, there is a storm that's making its way toward Florida and I wanted to make sure that we were checking in with each other, staying up to speed with everything that's going on. And I especially wanted to make this for those of you who may have family down here who are vacationing, you're concerned, you want some updates. So um, we're gonna be checking in regularly. These are just gonna be kind of short videos where I give you some updates, I show you what's going on here. I live about five minutes from Walt Disney World, so what I'm experiencing is pretty close to what they're experiencing over on Walt Disney World property. And I've been through a number of storms in the past. I am not new to this. So I wanted to make sure that I could help you take a breath because this can be a scary moment. Whether you're here and experiencing something like this for the first time somewhere far from home, or if you have family that is here and you just don't know what's going on. So we're gonna get through this together. We're gonna keep checking in with each other through the duration of the storm. And we're starting with an update about headlines, okay? So first and foremost, I know that some of the scariest things about storms like this are the headlines. Look, they're sensationalized. A lot of people want to have you click and stay tuned to their station and that can cause a lot of fear. So let's talk a little bit about how to manage those, how to figure out what you're seeing, okay? First and foremost, something that you need to be aware of is that Florida is a pretty big place. And the way that we experience things here in Central Florida is different from the way that they're experienced on the coast. So as you're seeing a lot of these headlines and you're seeing some of the nasty conditions that are being experienced on the coast, understand that here in the Central Florida area at the Walt Disney World Resort, it's a different experience altogether. Now, as you can see, currently here, we've got some rain. Um, we've got some rain, we've got some wind. It is... <laughs> blowing my direction but this is about the extent of it right now there isn't much else happening now i'm in kind of a sheltered area as you can see i got some trees there's some buildings on the other side of those trees um if you're in a tower if you're in kind of a more open area you might be experiencing things a little bit different but for the most part everyone well not for the most part as long as you're inside and you're at the Walt Disney World Resort right now, you're gonna be good to go. Now, here's why I feel confident saying that. First and foremost, Disney has built their resort hotels to withstand conditions like this. They've built everything to withstand conditions like this. And while there are some more vulnerable places on Walt Disney World property, Disney has gone ahead and evacuated guests out of those areas so that they're gonna stay safe during the storm. So if you had family who are staying at the campgrounds and a camper, They've all been evacuated out of the campsite. They're all in a resort hotel and safe. Those who are staying in the treehouse villas, the bungalows, the cabins, they've all been moved to a more secure location and Disney's doing their best to make sure that they are safe, they have everything they need, and they're entertained for the most part over the next couple days. Disney's also gone ahead and closed the theme parks today and tomorrow. This includes Disney Springs and the water parks, everything like that. And there are a bunch of policies that have changed for the next couple days. You can find out all about them over on the My Disney Experience app by clicking that hurricane tab. I'm not gonna go through all the details. You can read all about it yourself. Make sure you check that out so you know everything that's going on. Beyond that, like I said, this is what we're dealing with right now. We will, of course, continue to update you, but until then, let us know how you're making out. Keep in touch with us by leaving a comment, and we will talk to you soon. Bye.